All right, what's good, everybody? Max Stitcher today here today, and I'm here we're gonna go over some 1.24 patch notes over Guilty Gear Strive. Which the patch, look at the patch. It may seem like it's not much, but hey, it actually has some good system changes, which I may or may not go over in another video, but we shall see. Anyway, today we're go, go, going to go look at my character May, who's been always been nerfed in every single patch, but this patch. She actually got some good ass buffs. So let's go ahead and just off. We'll start off with four jump, increased movement distance. Like before, her four jump would be like as much as her back jump, but now her four jump's like whoop. So definitely it's gonna be good for like approaching now, especially with her jump H. It's gonna have some that little extra reach, like, oh, I think I'm safe. No, you're not. I'm gonna get that jump H. But yeah, that's actually a good buff. Just four jump, just a little simple buff, like kind of quality of life, but. It just makes me that much better. Okay, let's just go ahead with our next one. It's a, it's a 3K. Increase active frames and reduce recovery. So, so this is hella more active. Like with that, before that probably would have whiffed. That's too far. So it has, it has those, it has those increased active frames. And recovery, let's see. Let's send Kai to block right quick. It's probably gonna still get punched by the Sun Dipper. Yeah, it still gets a punish, but uh, let's see. Let's, let's actually make Kai do. After a block, let's, let's actually have him do, like, I don't know, just a. I guess, a standing guess. So that's what Kai's like to do to start your offense. Ooh. Okay, close is punish. But if you space it, you just get a progress. Before, that would have been death. That would have been super death. Well, like I said, that's actually good. Especially, I think that's a good compromise cause for taking out the hard knockdown. Because, like, not having the hard knockdown but then still making it that punishable, it was kind of ridiculous. But, hey, at least we got something out of that. And then, like I said, active frames. So, this is going to be a nuisance. Since probably most characters won't be able to, prop to punish it properly. If you, especially if you space it. Jumping to eight, eight and a half hard slash. Now triggers counter effect. Now what does that mean? So it just you know that big counter shit? That now she gets that. Which is kinda ridiculous. But that's kinda that's kinda OD. So yeah, now two eight now you gotta be careful with that, because like people say, oh you wanna do a jump eight, I'm like, nope, I'm gonna do this. Thank you, what is this? Ooh. Oh my god, why aren't you dashing? But yeah, anyway, yeah, this is another, it just makes every, it just makes it more combo-able. Because like, whether you got a combo or not, was like, you're at the mercy. You're at the mercy of that. Look at how much damage that does. 212, even with the system-wide or game-wide, whatever you call it. The whole, the, I forgot what you call it. It's not system-wide. Uh, let's see the universe, the mechanic changes and whatnot. That's and like they increase damage across the board, but uh, yeah, you, she still gets that. Uh, she still gets a lot of damage from that. So I like this change. Yeah, and this patch for her is just nothing but buffs, which is rare because she has been getting the nerf hammer for way too long for no reason too. But okay, let's go out and move on to the next one, Mr. Dolphin Horizontal, all versions. Well, you need to hold it, or you, yeah, you, you use the charge motion, charge back, full for us, ace, 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 reduce recovery on hit or block. So, what is, so, yeah, what does that mean? Oh, let's use this. So, used to be Kai can actually, if you didn't dolphin out of bad range, Kai could actually uh, punish you for it. Now, yeah, he can't punish you anymore. But I can punish him for trying to do that. So there's no fear in doing Dolphin, of course, with a little more less recovery on the H version as well. It's plus as I it's it's even more plus now. So I think you can even challenge. Okay, you can't challenge that because Stun is a stupid move, but still. Still though. That's kind of insane that, that it's now more plus pretty much since it has less recovery. So people that doesn't have stuff, something like Stun Dipper, yeah, good luck with trying to do that. And then you can't, Kai can't, that was one of my most problem, problem things in this matchup with Kai. 
specifically. He can punish Dolphin. Now he can't. So again, a really, really good quality of life buff. Of course, at that time, I just didn't hold block, but dude, I'm just, I'm just kind of shook that Arxis would like buff her like this. Okay, now that that's over, we're gonna go on to the last one. Ari Sugawab Sparkle, all versions. Hitbox now remains after the projectile hits the ground. So what this means is, okay, let me, it's hard to actually set this up. It actually has a, it actually has a, a, a area of effect explosion. So that means, so you're just like, oh, I'm just gonna chill. I'm out of the range. No, you're not. This is actually a good freaking zoning tool. Like, stay back from me. I like, that's kind of, like, the hitbox on that is insane. Jeez. So pretty much, if you keep the, if this is actually a good move to use at full screen, even right here, you, it's a good move. Like, I can't believe they buffed that too. I'm like, I looked at that initially and I thought, nah, this ain't a good, this is kind of whatever. But then I'm just now nah, looking at it in practice, I'm like, this is actually freaking amazing. Look at that. So it seems like in this fight they did try to promote more kind of zoning tools. But bro, that's kind of ridiculous. Okay, just out of range. Yeah, look at that. The air, the explode, like it has the hitbox on the ground now, which is very great. So overall, May got buff, buff. She got buff. She's gonna be a menace again. Like she was a menace at the start, then they nerfed her. She was still fine. Then the last patch came, they kind of just nuked her, but now they kind of just elevated her back up. So I'm actually happy, even though I'm still gonna play Bacon or Bacon because it's. I don't. I think the Ram matchup is still gonna be annoying to deal with, but maybe the Kai matchup is not gonna be as bad because I can just throw out a Dolphin, which is gonna be great. So anyway, that's gonna be it for the May video. I'm definitely going to make a Testament video and probably a Biking video, even though I have not played her that long. But like, I kind of know what she does. It's not that hard to make a patch video. So yeah, I'm gonna probably release all of them at once because it is like almost five o'clock in the morning. I can't sleep, so I'm just like, you know what? I'm just gonna make do make some content, put it on the YouTube, do all that. So anyway, I wanna thank y'all for watching. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button. You like the video? Like it, share it, and again, subscribe. And I'll do more of these patch videos when, of course, when the patches come out. So anyway, that's gonna be it for me. I'm gonna see you in the next uh, patch video, and I will see y'all later.